I saw this the other day. When there is darkness all around, whether it's literal darkness, <laughs> even I'm recording, you can kind of see it's a little darker today out and cloudy. If there is hard stuff going around, you are the light. There's a bunch of mean people, rude people, stressed people, angry people, fighting, whatever's going on. What is the best thing to do? Be the light. Find the light in yourself. Bring it out. Now, I know I talk about skills and things that can make you more money and those types of things, but we also are trying to live good lives. We're trying to help the world. We're trying to help ourselves. And so if you want to do that, you have to help yourself and realize that you are the light. You have the potential here to change a situation around. You have the potential here to make a situation better. You do. It's how you look at things. It's how you choose to approach things. And so how can you treat somebody else better? How can you make a situation more fun for people? I know as a teacher, I'm trying to make things fun and set up the environment. And so it is a little bit more enjoyable, right? You are the light. You have the potential to put good into people, right? doesn't mean you have to be walked all over or that you always are nice or you never stand up for yourself or you don't say this is wrong. This needs to stop. But how can we be more light? And I think when a lot of people get discouraged, I've seen, or like if you watch the news a lot um, and there's a lot of pain and hardships or sad things happening all the time. Remember, there are a lot of good things happening around the world as well. And so what's the best thing to do? If you are believe in religion or Christianity or anything like that, you know, like God is love. You are love. You are light. And so if you get discouraged, that is one of um, darkness's biggest tool is to be discouraged. Like the people who want to do good, want to get wealthy, want to do good things with their wealth, want to be kind to people, want to help people, want to support people. And then you're discouraged and then you're like, oh, what's the point? And I can't do anything or what can I do? And then you put your own light out. Another light's not shining. Another light's not shining. Another light's not shining. It doesn't mean you can't have a moment or struggle and you're having a hard time, but then re get back in the game, get back out there and go help people. Right? If it's a this versus this, and you just have all these people on this team out of the game, who's probably going to win? So we need more people full of light and choosing to be that. If there's darkness all around. You can choose to be the light. You can choose to say that, like Martin Luther King Jr., right? Love, hate doesn't drive out hate. Only love can do that. Light or dark doesn't drive out dark. Only light can do that, right? So profound. Be the light. Don't forget that you are that. If you feel sad about a situation, remember that you have the power to do something, right? Maybe you can't go help the cause that you want to help, but you could help somebody else or you could feed love and support your family and at least take care of your family. Or if you have a job and how can you support those people there? If everybody did that, if everybody did that with their own selves, with their own families, with their own jobs or communities, and everybody took care of each other, things would be so much better. <laughs> it would spread, right? So don't underestimate the power of that. That's an easy thing to say too, is like, what impact could one person do? I'm just one person. Think about this even too. Taylor Swift, she's been in the game a long time, but Taylor Swift, billionaire, impacts how many shows has she just sold out and sold out and sold out with 80,000 people each show. You're telling me that one person can't make some impact, even if it is just with singing and helping them and enjoying, like, no, we can't. And even if you're not on that level, if this person says, yes, I can't make an impact, this person, this person, this, and they all, everyone starts to believe that, then of course, there's going to be so many more that believe that they actually can make a difference. And so instead, if we're saying, oh, I can't make a difference. And then someone who could have made a difference goes, I can't make a difference. Oh, I can't make a difference. Oh, I can't make a difference. And all these people who could have made a difference get out of the game, then it's going to be a lot harder for all of us who are out there trying to fight and trying to put good into the world. So don't forget that you are light. You have light within you and you can bring it out at any time. It doesn't mean you have to be perfect or like that you have to feel happy all the time and do good all the time. But the best way to drown out the darkness is to be the light. The best way to drown out the darkness anywhere is to be that light. So go spread it. Let's all unite together, right? Let's all take care of ourselves together. Let's all build our financial 
health. Let's all build our spiritual health. Let's all build our actual health and go out and do good in the world together. So thanks so much for being here. You've got this. I believe in you. I believe and I see the light in you. Let's all bring that out together and go shine the light into the world. We need it. And there's so many people already doing that. So let's go join them. You got this. Feel free to like and subscribe for more. I'll see you in the next one. Keep shining bright. Bye guys.